Right, and in other news, a tragedy has struck Tumoek village in Kipkelion West, Kericho County, after six members of the same family died in a Sunday midnight house fire. According to the area chief Alice Yagon, a poor road network and terrain posed a great challenge to rescue efforts, forcing villagers to watch helplessly as fire consumed the homestead. And as Winfrey Owino reports, only one member of the seven survived the incident. Residents of Tumwek village in Kericho County woke up to scenes of the remains from a fire incident that consumed three female adults and minors on Sunday night. The victims perished in their sleep as the timber house was reduced to ashes, leaving behind one kin, Dennis Kiprotich, a 30-year-old man. He narrates how the incident happened. <laughs> Kiprotich had traveled from a neighboring village alongside one of his deceased aunts to help relatives harvest maize. Due to water challenges, neighbors who rushed to the scene watched helplessly as the six succumbed to the inferno. Tukakuja kujaripu kusaidia hii familia lakini haiku ya sakana. Eh, tulijaripu hata kufungua mlango ingawa moto ilikuwa imezidi na tukufanikiwa. So tukapodeza hawa majirani wetu watu sita wa familia moja. Capquen Sublocation Assistant Chief Alice Yegon says poor road network frustrated rescue efforts. Additionally, local leaders call on the county government to allocate emergency funds for infrastructure development in the marginalized Kunyak ward. Nikutoa tu wito kwa serikali yetu ya county government ya Kericho kwamba SMU inahitaji allocation kubwa kuliko hata ile budget yenye tunafanyaga kwa county government yetu kupitia kila wodi. Tuna baba mwenye amepoteza mke wake, amepoteza watoto wake watatu, amepoteza dada yake na amepoteza shemeji yake. So ni jambo nzito kabisa na tunasema pole kwa familia. Ile hii achali vile ilitokea. Watu wa hapa walikuwa wanakimbia kwenda kuita machirani wa kuche wa ukoi. Lakini kufika hapa the child remains of the six deceased persons have been taken to St. Vincent Hospital Mortuary in Muhoroni pending post-mortem. When free or in OKTN News. And in other unfortunate news, a Kenyan student who drowned more than two months ago 